hi guys yeah welcome back to prospect channel tv thank you very much for always stopping by please do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you have not thank you very much once again may god bless you all alleged plan to kill Namdekano in dss court study to stop agitations for Biafra nation in Southeast reviews. <laughs> they say, well, I'll be like bicycle. Hmm. This one tough. Oh. Report reaching us right now says IPOP leader Mazin Namdekano have once again cries out. Recall that this is not the first time, not the, not the second, not the third time Namdekano has been saying one thing. I think it's high time. Nigerians have to listen to him. Now the Kano cries out that it seems that the Nigerian government, Buhari government, have different plans for him consigning the agitations for Biafra nations. He then urges his supporters and his followers to pray without ceasing for him against the plans of the enemies to eliminate him. <laughs> they say, well, I'll be like bicycle. Hmm. <laughs> if I thought Nigerian government is planning something like this, they should just have to back off hmm. to, 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 to avoid problems in Nigeria, to avoid stories that touches. I don't think killing this guy will stop anything. In fact, if you kill him, you are not giving more room to agitate agitations in Nigeria because already, like what I always say, that Mazen Namdekano have regret his him himself in the southeast. Thousands of them they are waiting and watching how the federal government, you know, is going to treat Mazen Namdekano, you know, in this issue. Record that the justice justice uh, Binta Inyako, a joint trial of IPOB leader Namdekanu to June 28. And Nigerians not to like waiting happen. People complain. Why then they are joining Mazen Namdekanu case today, tomorrow, and all that? If the federal government knows that this man, you know, is guilty, why can't you just give this this case space for once tomorrow you are joining the case next tomorrow you give this excuse and all that because the nigerian government knows that they have no case against the ipop leader look at what is going on in the southeast today southeast one of those regions when they enjoy peace they don't turn them upside down anything when they happen ipop members Anything when they happen, ESN members, because they, those people who are doing this thing, they want to see IPOB members and ESN the way they are seeing them. That is it. Killing in Nigeria has become a daily, a daily stuff. No day when you wake up saying, "No, go hear bad news." But why this Southeast own the pay me be say? Southeasterners, they are not violent people. Like what I will always say, and I'm continuing to say this. Make them check what is going on in the South is carefully. You understand? Make them check them very well. Because these people, they're not the key people. We know Southeasterners to be business people. These people, they are very creative. Anywhere when business, they, any business when no, when not they move where. They will make out something out of nothing. That is what they are known for. But killing a pregnant woman, killing every other person, you look straight to a pregnant woman's eyes and you killed her. You killed her children, innocent children. That matter gets us to be. So know how when they go take turn that matter, make it not get us to be. Southeast leaders, so now they hear matter, so they could not do something. Now, coming back to what Mazin Namdekano have said, 
like as I said in the beginning, that this is not the first time Nandi Kano has been, you know, saying this plan to eliminate him. And we, you, you, if you can also recall, there was a time he cried out that the DSS was actually stabbing him in the custody. So when Nigerians begin talk, 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 we can't see, say, you know, maybe they don't try. If you watch the picture he took with uh, the governor of Anambra State, okay, Nigerians, okay, uh, he realized he don't, he don't actually change that uh, in clothes when they wear the comb, the comb court. You understand? The Nigerian government should not do anything funny. Why they even adjoin his trial? We don't know. Okay, let's just quickly hear this. Why they did that? The trial of Nam the Kano, the detained leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, earlier scheduled to continue on Thursday, that is tomorrow, May 26, has now been adjoined to June 28, 2022. Kano's lawyer, Ifani Ijafo, stated this in an update on his Twitter handle on Wednesday, adding that the presiding judge, Justice Binta Inyako, was indisposed okay so because um justice enyako was indisposed that so that is the reason why that is the reason the court is given that is the reason why they have adjoined Maz Mazadam the Kanu's case again to june 28. you see all these came when they play if you play finish go left right and center you are still going to come back because all these things will yield nothing. Release him if you know that um, you actually want to enjoy peace in the southeast. Release him and let this man go to to go back to his region and talk to his people. You know why I said this? Those people who were behind the agitations for Biafra to commit crimes. Once they release Mazinam the Kano, that means they don't have anywhere to hide again. So that means all these killings here and there will stop. The federal government should not kill this man. They should do him nothing. Because asking for self-determination is not a crime. Come to think of it, if the government was actually doing the needful, would uh, Mazinam the Kano come out to say, okay, if this is how you are treating us, Give us our freedom. Let's leave Nigeria. May the sit think and go into the roots of agitations and correct whatever these people are saying. You are not going to tell us that they are not making sense. Not by going after agitators. By doing that, you are making series of mistakes again and again and again. And that is why we are here today. The mistake they made in that first time by invading his house, and killed people and all that the mistake they've made that up to now they have refused to call agitators in a round table talk and discuss but they don't find it difficult to agitate with bandits and the uh, Boko Haram members who have decided you know to 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 unleash their evil activities on the, on innocent Nigerians I'm dropping it here guys Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you very much for stopping by. Bye.